I'm having an instant message conversation with Jim McFadden. Jim McFadden, McFadden is a very technical computer guy who also works part-time at Morton College on the weekends in the Plus area. Um, Jim and I go way back and we've had conversations over the years about some pretty technical things and a few weeks ago he showed me a software called showmypc.com it's free and it requires very little attention what happens is you would go to showmypc.com which I've entered here and you go to a site that looks like this um, I have instant messenger up because um, Jim knows that I'm recording and he's going to send me a code so what he does is he comes and he clicks on show my PC to a remote user and I'm not gonna click on that because he's gonna show me uh, his code first and then he's going to instant message me the code. It's a number. And what I do is I go on View Remote Users PC. So he's going to send me the code, which I believe he's doing right now. You can see that he's typing. Okay, let me give you the number. He said I'm going to click on View Remote Users PC. And it will give me a... Uh, a file that opens that will say do you wish to save I use Firefox you can probably tell that by the upper left hand corner really upper left hand corner of my screen but if you use Explorer or Netscape Navigator it might um, come up with a little bit of a different looking box so mine I'll say save file and then true to Firefox I'll get another window that will open it says show my PC and I click open says you know this could be a malicious file and it's not and I know that it's safe it's to the best of my knowledge it is I'm gonna go to view a remote users PC and then I'm gonna go back to my instant message code and I'm gonna say ready and um, you can kinda see where where I'm at here so I want you to take a look at my screen okay now he gave me this code and what I'm gonna do is copy the code. Oops, shoot, missed it. Let me try it again. I'm right clicking on it, copy, and then I'm right clicking on the get password from presenter and paste, and then OK. And it's connecting right now. And starting the viewer. OK, so now you can see Jim McFadden's screen. Um, let me ask him a question. That's it. That's, this is actually his computer. And then I'm going to say, um, can you see me? This is on my screen. Or, I mean, oops, I can see you. <laughs> LOL. See, now I can see he's going. Oh, there you are. Okay, he opened up his window. So my window's down here. Yeah. Okay, cool. So you could see that I've been able to go ahead and actually view his desktop. Let me ask him a question. I'm going to go down to my instant messenger, um, Jim, and you could actually see Catherine Stuckel is typing on his screen. I'm going to say, Jim, um, is there a file I can open on your desktop? to show people or is that too private which one which file okay you can see I'm typing on mine and then it's coming across on his I can actually just watch his from now on I can do anything I want from his desktop. I can actually click down here. And see, I can see his start menu and all of his goodies up here. Firezilla, Visual Studio email, things like that. Let me see what he said I could do. Um, let me just type him back and say I opened his start menu. Um, I opened your start menu. PC data. Okay, let's see here. Okay, he said to open PC data, so I'm going to go and minimize PC data. Okay, let's see here. 
Dan. PC data. I don't know where his folders are. Ah, his desktop is as bad as mine. PC data. Go to search. I'm actually on his desktop. <laughs> That's so cool. Well, I'm not going to go through and open his files, but you get the point. Um, let me see this. But I have demonstrated. Let me open his file up. <laughs> Oh, PC data. Oh, okay. Oh, PC DC data. I don't know where it's at. PC data. Okay. I don't know where it's at. Can't find it. Can you point to it? You keep your stuff hidden. Can you find it and point to it? You can see in the background, though, this is my desktop over here. Okay, now he's going to... Oh, he just pointed to it here? That is so cool. I can go right into his files. I got good software. <sighs> okay, let's tell him we can cut. Oh, he's doing it for me. Oh, oh. That's fancy. I'm recording myself talking to you. This is actually what I'm saying aloud. I think I'll make one video on how to use show my okay you can see that he's closed the connection show my PC and then another on how to show you mine turn the recorder off find the recorder to turn off. There we go. You can see I use Cam Studio.